if you have a friend that moves in with you and she brings a friend to help you move and that friend just stays there and does just keeps coming back that you should just be friends with them too. One of our mutual friends moved in with me and Alex helped that friend move in and then he just kept coming back and I didn't know why because sometimes the other friend wasn't even there and he'd just come hang out with me and he just kept coming back. So. We just really enjoyed hanging out, spending time together. Um, it really didn't matter what we were doing, you know, we could just be sitting around hanging out and talking and that would be enough for, you know, the both of us. Well, not a thing uh, is what she told her family to describe who I was after we had start seeing each other. Um, we hadn't officially decided we were dating at this time, but we were pretty close to it. <laughs> so I found out about it a little later on and I just haven't been able to let her go about it. I just keep going on about it. But I guess now, um, now it's it is a thing. A thing. So <laughs> I had to let it go. I pray that one by one we'll make promises to keep standing underneath the shade tree. Darling, I love you. And if by chance you pray for me, one by one, let's be. It's actually my favorite part of the wedding. When the groom sees his bride. It's my favorite part. Who gives this woman to marry this man? Her family. Madison, I've never been extremely good with my words, but hey, you're close enough. I will be your constant. The person you can turn to in troubling times. Promise with everything I am to love and cherish every moment we share together. Through the good and the bad. To hold your hand on our morning walks with Otis, the dog. And at night, when Otis is chasing the cat. I know that we have a love that will stand the test of time. I'm no longer, you're not a thing. Safe to say that I am a thing now. <laughs> On this day, I take you to be no one other than yourself as my husband. I choose you to learn and grow with in all of our days to come. In our future of joy and struggle, strength and weariness, direction and doubt, I promise to respect you in everything as an equal partner. As we continue to grow in our relationship with each other, the Lord, and our community, I promise to always hold space for laughter, kindness, and vulnerability. As you said first, almost three years ago to date, I love you. Thank you for choosing me to be your lifelong friend, partner, and wife. So you'll take the ring and place it on Maddie's ring finger. Repeat after me. With this ring, I be wed. With this ring, I be wed. With all my worldly goods. With all my worldly goods. I be in thou. I be in thou. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Ghost. And of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Maddie, we place the ring on Alex's finger. With this ring, I be wed. And with all my worldly goods, I be in thou. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Now to husband and wife. Alex, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Appropriately, right? <laughs> Promises to keep standing underneath the shade tree. Darling, I love you. 
I'm hoping that you pray for me One by one, let's be Introducing the wedding party. Caitlin and Brayden. Sandra. Folk, Justine and Mariah. Ethan and Lila. Jordan and Kelly. Mitch and Dana. And for the first time, the husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Alex and Madison Rector. Thank <laughs> you. 
and I know I give you crap for it, but I probably will. Alex, it has been easy. It really has. And you and I both know that. I'm proud of the man who we I'm proud of the young lady married. I'm glad she can keep you in line because that responsibility is now gone. <laughs> And I know I'm supposed to make it short because you'll soon learn. Your wife will tell you what to do, and that's how it goes. And I was told to keep it short. Alex, despite all the things we've gone through, I'm going to leave you this last advice that Dad gave me when I got married. And he said, Son, at the end of the day, remember this love today. When things are bad and things are tough, this is what you look back on too. Because this is what is important. Not anything else that happens in your life other than this day. The love that you have will never be any better than what you have right now. So to that, I wish you both the best of luck. And I'm proud of you both. Congratulations. Okay.